guys, welcome to today's video. Isn't it so strange to see me in a new location alongside James? We're still married. Oh my, God. <laughs> what? <laughs> um, okay, yeah, that was, you know, every time I'm in Seattle, I still get that. Like, are you guys still married? Like, is, are you, did you move there alone? I'm like, no, we're together, we're good. Um, and in fact, I have convinced my husband to spend the afternoon not even unboxing the unboxed items, but just rifling through. You're gonna be like my, um, what helper. are you? My helper. So this is what happened. Um, we had all the PR from LA shipped up here. My son Taylor went and picked everything up. He spent time unboxing everything, filmed a little unboxing, and then he put it in a big box and sent it up here. And we got a big box. We're gonna be opening up the big box and makeup. Yes, it's a lot. And honestly, I am overjoyed because I, like everyone else, have not been out and about. And the idea of playing with new things is just like, like I'm just, we just need to go. And can we just say for a minute, how about my hair? I mean. I think I've never needed a haircut so bad. I'll she, do it. She's been trying to say, hey, let me cut your hair. And I'm like, no, I know. it's not happening. I want to do it on camera. Yeah. I saw those scissors you ordered. You're not I cutting my hair. I actually did. I ordered scissors. I'm going to cut your hair. No, you're not going to cut it's my hair. It's happening. It's not happening. It's going to. Let's get to an unboxing. It's so we've got- Oh, speaking of it, hair, hair goals. goals. <laughs> I'm normally not hair goals lately. I feel like I need a bottle of hair dye. That needs to happen. I need some scissors. Should I cut my own hair? No. Oh, that would be bad, right? <laughs> I will cut your hair. No, you won't. <laughs> um, okay, I have some L'Oreal Dream Length. Ooh, this looks pretty. Um, do you guys remember when I used to use that L'Oreal? It was a mask, it's yellow in a jar. I loved this deep conditioner and I talked about it nonstop. I've really been in the mood to play with more L'Oreal hair care, so. It's a really fun story. I'm, I hope you enjoyed it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, moving on. Lalicious. Um, it's, it's peachy lalicious. clean. It's <laughs> lalicious. So delicious. Oh my gosh, mm. I've never um, seen a peach one. Extraordinary whipped sugar scrub. I love Lalicious so much. It is probably one of the brands where like with the scrubs and even like they have a beautiful like oil body butter and lotions. Like I get sad if I'm running out and so I am a little more sparing and a little more modest. Anyway, I just love their products and this is a newer scent. I've tried like every scent that they have. I don't like peaches personally, but I know you do. You don't like it? I don't like peaches. Oh my God. <sighs> This is the reason why. I grew up in North mm. Carolina. My grandmother was in South Carolina and my grandmother used to buy like peaches by the bushel. And every time I'd come in, she'd be like, Jimmy, do you want a peach? That's how and she talked. <laughs> yeah, and <laughs> I, I just got peaches pushed on me all the time that I never liked them. I've been boycotting them ever since I was a small child. You know the peach emojis is, is, um, is code for a booty, right? Really? Did you know that? No, I so did So you just not. said that you didn't like ass. Really? Just saying. Well, I don't like ass by the bushels. Oh, shit. <laughs> Check it out. Would you like some YSL? Ooh. Ooh. Mm. Yes, I would. How, like, speaking of peach, how satisfying is the shade of this compact? It's luxurious. It's a bronzer, I think. Touche Claw, 3D all over glow. Okay, it's gonna make me glow everywhere. I think that I am actually going to love this. This is beautiful. Made in France. Oh yes, I approve. This is nice. Wow. We have some Kosas. We've got a moisturizer baked bronzer and a moisturizing baked bronzer. Blah, blah, blah. A baked bronzer? A baked bronzer. Wow, oh, put some muscle into it. There we go. See, your help was definitely needed. Actually, I'm just lonely when I film and anything I can do to reel him in to sit next to me and play, and well, you're not playing with makeup, but just like be with me is nice. I'm playing helper. It's lonely these days, you guys. I'm just tired of hanging out with the same people. <laughs> you know what? 
Ooh. Same. It's really pretty. It's got like a satiny finish. You're doing a good job. Thank you. And it's domed. You're doing a good job. I like how it's like raised. Smell it though. Doesn't it smell like unfrosted donuts? It does. Like not the frosting, not no. the sweet, but like the bread. Like a plain donut. Yeah. I love the color of the packaging. Okay, we shall see if this is moisturizing or not. That's an interesting claim for a bronzer, but thank you to Kosas. We have stuff from number seven. Lucky. Looks like this number is a seven. mascara. This is some more stuff. This is pretty packaging. I actually have only had two mascaras here. Poor thing, only, you only have two mascara. I only have two <laughs> mascara. Now I have three. Now you have four. Woo! This one's waterproof. Look at that color. You can go swimming in the bathtub. I would like to test waterproof makeup for you guys. Uh, I think a lot of you were wondering about the waterproof mushroom cushion. I just had nowhere to waterproof it. There's just nothing. You should have asked for help. I would have thrown water at you. You've done that once before. Oh my God. Hey, we got some number seven uh, bronzers. We've got cool. gold and I sand. Cool, I really need that. We've got uh, caramel and then we got maple. That's your favorite. I love maple. It doesn't smell like maple. I would like, I could go so hard for a, a gluten free maple donut. Oh my God, you just made me like yearn for it. What's your favorite donut? Leave it in the comments. Bear claw. Oh my gosh. I just think those are too messy. Delicious. Okay. What we got? Sulwaso. Is that how it's pronounced? I'm pretty sure not, but I appreciate the effort. <laughs> Sulwaso concentrated. Ginseng Renewing Cream. I don't dig how it smells. I don't either. But do you know with skincare, I say this often, sometimes you just gotta toughen up and deal with uh, some funky smelling skin stuff and you get the results because it, the reality is the results are what matters, right? It smells like it has good stuff in there. It smells like it's gonna work. It doesn't have a sweet smell. You gotta keep that in mind with your face, right? We have 11 boxes of lashes. They're different brands. Let's have a, a nice breakdown. While I'm doing this, why don't you tell them how wonderful it is to ring the bell? You know, I wish that we had Logan here to tell them to ring the bell. Ring the bell. Ring the bell. Please subscribe to Tati's YouTube channel. And when you do so, ring the bell. You can select all or some. You should select all. What do you select? I'm not subscribed to your channel. Oh my God. I don't have a YouTube account. <laughs> <laughs> I don't, I don't have a Twitter, I don't have a Facebook, I don't have an Instagram. I know, how weird is it? Like I have, I, I think the one husband on YouTube in the beauty sphere that does not have social media, period. You don't do social. No. He said on our first date, he's like- he said, I never want to be know, famous. Couple months later, me in a tripod and I'm like, great, I'm starting a YouTube channel and, but you've yeah. always been supportive. Yeah. And you're so chill. I and just, let's let's round of applause for James, because honestly, he did not want this and you still support it. I'm not shading any of the guys out there. There are a lot of husbands. They've got really funny Instagrams. I mean, and, and really funny Twitters. I just, I don't have that sense of humor. I mean, there was that time I thought about starting that one, you know, that one <laughs> yes, YouTube channel. But. It was going to be called the channel of bad ideas. Mm -hmm. And it's where I was going to test really, really bad ideas. I was going to come up with really stupid products to launch and do it. Uh, and like make test products and and uh, do it like infomercial style and offer them up for sale because yes. they'd be so wacky and stupid. There's no the they, way they'd be successful. Terrible ideas. Yeah. It'd be like the reverse shark tank, like the worst ideas, bring it, right? And I like, thought it'd be hilarious content. I actually still think it is hilarious. And I have a file in one of my older phones where I have channel of bad ideas and I have all of the stupid conversations that we've had that we thought, channel of bad ideas. So what have we got there? Um, we, we got, got a lot some, of lashes. We got a lot of lashes. We got Lorella. We've got Lash DNA. More Lorella, but these look fancier than normal. Lash DNA, these are just two different brands. I'll do a nice insert for you guys. Um, I'm gonna be glamorous in quarantine. Thank you so much. The Wander Beauty Escape Palette. I think we can all agree that we're on the same page. Dun, 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 dun. By the way, we haven't left in seven weeks. <laughs> We're not exaggerating. <laughs> and we and we haven't thrown anything at each other yet. 
I know. <laughs> we still love each other. <laughs> Wait, we didn't clap well. <laughs> okay. Ooh. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's satisfying. I could just take a stroll down both lanes, swatch up my arm. I'm doing that later. Okay, great. This looks really pretty. Oh, it's a bonus. It's a bonus. We got more Lalicious. I'm so excited. Da, 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 Taking all this time da, da, to open something da, da. to smell that they can't smell. I can describe it, okay? Okay, please. You guys, we're on hit the, all the we're, Hit all the floral notes. Um, this is the Sugar Reef uh, Body Butter. It's sweet, but also smells like a sunset in Hawaii. Strolling on the beach, a hint of gardenia maybe? But it's bright. There's a little citrus, maybe some jasmine. I like it. Good job. How about? <laughs> I just turned around and like, Puka's so sick of her <laughs> just judging us. Some Sigma lipsticks and I'll show Puka. Puka got a bath last night. Puka got a bath he last night. He hated every minute of no, it. No, he didn't. He was such a good boy. You were a good boy, weren't you, Puka? He's silky now. Say hello to everyone. He needs, he needs a, a haircut. He so needs a bad. haircut too. Hi. Okay, Good he's like, boy. Dad, put me down. Um, ooh, these are individually like. I'm gonna open one of them. Look, it's like flat. Do you see that? It's like very flat. It's very. Ooh, okay. la la. That is very pigmented. I like it. Let's see, see that one. one. All right, so I have Epiphany and deja vu. That's, I've been feeling um, both of those words. I wonder if this is a good mascara. You wander? I do. I, I caught that. They have a catchy name. They call this one the Mile High Club. I have tried this one before, so I'm gonna put this in a giveaway bin. Um, I am also going to be donating some makeup. So I'm not doing an exact giveaway within this video as I normally do. I don't have as much stuff here, like full blown PR kits to give away. Um, but I still nonetheless don't need to keep all of this. And so just, we, you know, we can't it. go to the post office. No. So Ooh. we got some stuff from Ofra. I love Ofra. Um, we have a long lasting liquid lip in story. We have Millie. This looks really pretty. Is this a gloss? Yes. That's pretty. Just like a sheer gloss with some glimmer. Oh, you you got them all set up. Okay, good job. We have a highlighter, a bronzer, and a blush. Is this a collaboration? Do we uh, know? I know that Samantha March had a collaboration. Yes, it is. I'm right, I'm right. Okay, I am definitely going to try this out and update you guys. I want to full on support this because I think, um, it, well, I just want to because I like her and I like Ofra, but also, how do I say this? Just like bad timing for the world with, you know, collaborations. And like I empathize so much because I had a, a launch that had to be delayed and it's just a little bit weird right now. So if you can support your favorites um, in any way, even if it's not buying something, but just like leaving a nice comment or thumbsing up a video, like do it right now. Like we all need the extra love, love. This is from Milani. These look fun. Uh -huh. Yeah, they do. Ludicrous lights. I'm gonna do the shoulders or chest swatchy. What do we think? Do we see it? This is a really just like pleasing to the eye collection. I should do a video. I'm gonna restrain from like, and I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna do a video. How about some Origins Pretty in Bloom SPF 20? Well, wait, <laughs> you'll never see the sunshine again. Why do you need SPF? I'm kidding. <laughs> really depressing. I'm gonna try these. Ooh, what's this? Jungle Rock Spray. Oh, this is the Bretman Rock collaboration with Wet n Wild, which looked really cool online. Like really, um, not to diss on Wet n Wild, but it looked a little more elevated. A uh, very thoughtful collab. I, you know, I liked the pictures. It's nice to see it in person. This is the Prep Set Refresh. Ooh, that's a nice spray. Oh, freaking Maui Beach right here. That's nice. Laura Mercier. It looks like a deck of cards. Let's find out. Oh, well, it's game on. Let's play tonight. We went to Palm Springs once and that's like 
what we did. We literally played cards in our room, eating room service pizza, watching the sunset, and it was probably one of my favorite trips ever. And I think it's appropriate to share um, when you were first trying to like impress me and when we were first dating. Have I ever shared on my channel the card story? I can throw cards. So. Wait. <laughs> oh, that's so lame. James, you've lost your touch. I'm trying to hit the lens for them. They're small, they're just a little bit you're smaller. You're running, you're running out of chances. Than normal. Five hours later. There we go. Did you do it? I did. All right, so James had all sorts of tricks and cool card tricks and stuff like that that he would um, impress me with. So I stood on the other side of the room. I'm like, hey, watch this. And I tried to throw a card at a lamp and I hit her right on the forehead and cut her. I got a card paper <laughs> cut and I was not happy, but we were like in that falling in love phase and I couldn't be like not happy for too long. Um, you forgave me quickly. I forgave quickly, but I was like, dude, like you paper cut my forehead. <laughs> you were so horrified. You're like, oh my God, oh my God. Here's some pistache. Uh, pistachio oil hydrating hand cream. What's wrong? <laughs> I just rubbed this all over my white sweat. Oh, yeah. No, no. <laughs> this is nice hand cream. I already know this stuff smells great. Lorella. Lorella. And we got liquid uh, eyeshadow. Triple shot mascara. I would like a triple shot caramel macchiato from Starbucks. I actually, um, this is one of my suave moves like back in the day. I asked a guy out who worked at Starbucks by tipping him after pathetically flirting with him. And I put my really intricate drink order in the tip jar with my phone number. Did he ever call you? He did, we dated for a minute. <laughs> Ooh, what's this? This is nice. Drama Queen. This is the kimchi, kimchi. glow. And that is Koki. And Hank and Henry. And, ooh, I'm actually really excited for this. Um, Kristen Dominique has a new highlighter and it looks so good. Like, so, 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 so good. I'm really excited for it. Skin gloss. I don't know if it's a highlighter. It's a skin enhancer. Well, your face is a skin. Your face is a skin. Your face is a skin. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so what you got You there? can put it wherever you want. And put it on your butt. That would be a waste. Yeah. Okay, so we have this very interesting palette right here. We have Hank and Henry, Hank and Henry Nine Eyeshadow Palette. This is Spring Fling, very neon. Uh, I am gonna have some like makeup playtime, I'm excited. This is pretty, this is so just like candy colored, yummy. I'm back to craving a donut with maple for some reason. And here's Las Hermanas. Ooh, these look really, really nice. Wow. Oh my gosh, they swatch so nice too. And then we have Koki. We have double Koki. Double Koki. Is it the same one? No, it's no. different. Okay, so here's skin gloss. So I think the highlighter that you're referring to, it's like a lip gloss for your skin, hence skin gloss or highlighter as you know it. The packaging is nice. Let's take a moment to appreciate glossed peach. It's really high end. It feels like metal. It feels like I'm expensive. Um, this so. is beautiful embossed uh, on the actual compact itself. Wow, okay, this is exactly what I thought it would be. I'm just gonna do a swatch of this here. Yeah, that's really nice. That is so pretty. She did a great job. It is so hard to stand out in this very saturated space. And when you create something that has a little bit of a twist on it, where the pan size is very large, there are individual compacts. You can go in with a tool, brush it on the shoulders, the decollete, throw this on the lid, gloss up the lid, the cheeks, the lip. You can put this anywhere. You know, another trick that's really nice with um, any body highlighters, you guys, not that we're out there running around in our shorts having the best time ever, but once life gets back to normal, which it will, um, you can put straight down on your leg a little bit of highlighter and it just pours the light on that focused area and makes the skin look so nice and is so flattering. I can't wait to try those out completely. So thank you so much. Here's Bretman's. Here's Bretman's. 
Wet and Wild yes. palette. Okay, so I knew this had like beautiful kind of sunset, like gorgeous neon, but like ombre neon packaging. I love the packaging. I think it's really cool that Wet n Wild has a palette set up like this. Like I haven't seen that, I don't think. I'm gonna not even dive into this because I wanna do another influencers products tested. Shoot, I shouldn't have swatched um, the body gloss, but I did. Whatever, we'll put it you in there anyway. Test it. And I have another collab product. This is the Rose All Day with Exterior Glam. I feel like I already had this or have this. This may have been sent to me twice. I'll take it as a sign. This is the world's tiniest palette. It's by Jane Iredell. It's a pure basics eyeshadow this kit. This is not the tiniest. I've, I, I assure you, I have tested the tiniest. I'm sure you have. I don't even know <laughs> what that means, but um, I have. I'll, it, there's a thumbnail we can put up at James. <laughs> Lalicious, the oil restore and illuminate. This stuff smells like a just fantasy. I wore this when we were in Thailand. You'll have memories. Oh, yeah. Right? I love how fragrance will literally transport you back to a specific moment in your life. I so recommend if you have something special, your wedding day, a big event, a trip, like shake things up and have a new fragrance that you wear. And then every time in the future when you smell that fragrance, you're gonna just be triggered in your brain to go right back to that time. I love that. So the brand it. whose name I butchered, Solowasso, this packaging nice is like through the roof. You should feel the weight of it. It is like, oh, I feel like it's ceramic. I it think is, it is. I think it is. It's nice. so heavy. I think they sell this at like Neiman's. I think this is like a really high end luxe brand. Oh, Persona. <laughs> Oh my God, my legs asleep. Do you remember the time when I was filming and I was sitting on my leg? Yeah, and you stood up and <laughs> fell down. <laughs> I was like, thanks for watching guys. And I like stood up and we had it on, on film. I don't know where it is now, but I hit the ground so fast because my entire leg was asleep from sitting on it. Persona sent me some blush. It's super blush, Georgia. There's a lot of peaches going on these days. Peach everything, right? And the fruit of 2020 is peach. Why is everyone doing peach? What's your favorite fruit? What's your favorite fruit? Tomato. That is not. It is. I know uh, that's like a like trick question. <laughs> no, but it's really a fruit. My favorite fruit is salsa. Well, I, well, there you go. We like the same fruit. Mine this makes smells like sauce. dirty hot dog water. I'm not even joking. Skin like, okay, I'm so good at describing scents, and I'm gonna just have you just imagine hot dog water. <laughs> but it works, okay? You just toughen up and you use ferulic acid because it works, but it smells like dirty hot dog water. Smell it. No. No, do it. Oh, oh. <laughs> I never want to eat a hot dog again. I love SkinCeuticals. They make fabulous products. This was no shade, no shade. This is a Touche Claw Blur Primer. I hate it when you pump and nothing comes out. It's because it's new. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> You just look like such a mess. <laughs> Laura Mercier. I am overwhelmed by the amount of these in my hands. I will investigate, but I do like Laura Mercier. It's very high end. It's a pleasant line and I need to be filming more videos with new products. So thank you so much. Okay, okay what else? What do Before you have? Before we get to the favorite thing, someone was nice enough to send us iodine. Who sent this? I don't Who know why. This? Who sent this? Should I be concerned? Thank you. Okay, drum roll, please. I it's the see, last I can thing. Oh, Kevin. Oh. Oh. Ooh. These are lipsticks. Oh my gosh, I saw these online. Fatal Shine. Very nice. It's a full coverage, shiny, and nice consistency. I will be trying these 100% for sure. And the unforgettable lip definer. That's a large box. Oh, it has a um, 
sharpener in here, that's why. I love Kevin Aquan lip pencils. Uh, they are really nice and they just have a nice tone to them, texture. Um, they like blend out really nicely if you take a brush and you kind of want to pull the color inward a little bit. Yes, I've needed a liner like this. What's on the other end? It's a brush. This is exciting. We're done. I like it a lot. We're done. We're done. And that means that I get to go and play with makeup and plan out and research and figure out what I want to film for you guys. So please let me know in the comments below what you would like to see first because I'm looking at this collection and I'm like, okay, I could do influencer products, high-end luxury, drugstore. Uh, there's a lot that I could do here. Thank you guys so much for hanging out. I know this was a very different unboxing, but I appreciate you watching this video. Um, thumbs it up if you enjoyed it, share it, leave a comment, make sure you're subscribed, ring the bell, and um, high five in the comments for James being here. You're the best. And, I, and you're not cutting my hair. Oh, yes, I am. No, you're not. What will it take? I don't know. What do you guys think? Do I need a haircut? Does she need to cut my hair? On that note, you guys go have a good one. Be blessed. Take care and love one another. Drink some water. Get good rest. Think positive thoughts. And know that we love you so much. And thanks for hanging out. All right. Love you guys. All right. Bye. Mwah.